Now about a week ago, I came to the lagoon here near Dolly's Rocks, only about 200 meters down the road is Dolly's Rocks. Came here to do the YouTube video and I'll put the link to this video here talking about my Z62. But when I got here, the amount of birds that were here was incredible. The amount of royal spoonbills that I've never seen in flocks before. There would have been about 40 of them. Also, there was quite a lot of egrets around, little egrets, intermediate egrets, great egrets. So I took quite a lot of photos and especially video of these birds before I did my YouTube video. So this video will show you the birds that I saw on that day. So this is all good. There's a gate here. Sometimes it's closed, sometimes it's open. Before I go in here, you can see there's a very cleaned area here. And to my right here, there's a big sign saying no entry, authorized persons only. This is the farmer's land. We only go into this area here where it says the lagoon bird watchers welcome. This is the bird hide. Now bear in mind that you're quite a bit of a distance from the birds. So really you need at least a four to 500 millimeter lens here to get any nice photos. You can see the lagoon's just there. That's the start of it. And this is the bird height. So it's very good. There's heaps of viewing areas. You can see that. Shows you some of the waders and all that that you can find in this area. Gives you a bit of description of some of the birds here. There's a few seats. You can see there's some low viewing platforms, some middle and some up high ones. This one here is right on the corner and this gives you a great view to this area here, right in front. This is the area where I find that there's the most birds. If we go over here, this gives you a very good view from this next one here of the birds right in front of us here. I can see we have some little egrets, some intermediate egrets, and I think there's one eastern great egrets, and also some black winged stilts. Then if we keep going, I find all the way to the end here, this last one, this gives you a great view of the end of the lagoon. But shooting straight through here on this side here, there's a big tree there which really limits your view. So I find that I have the one all the way on the left, one here in the middle, and this one here. These three I find are the best. So this gives you a, an overall view of the lagoon. And here's some drone footage now of what this area looks like from above. I have never seen this many spoonbills here at the lagoon at Dolly's Rocks. Amazing. This is just one of the flocks here. There was a huge flock on the other side that took off. So happy to see this. Cormorant over there. Got a few Pacific black ducks. Very blowy, so you can probably hear that in the video. And here we're just picking away. It's funny, these birds have hardly moved from here. for royal spoonbills there feeding away the black cormorant there when i first got here i thought that this was a crow sitting on the post there but it's a black cormorant
Wow, did you just see that egret? And it's picking on the little egrets here. Can we pan around and see them? Well, the size difference between an eastern great egret and the little egrets. Eastern great egret just towers over the little egret. Oh, the swamp hen just chased that eastern great egret out of the way. A little bit of commotion there. Getting a bit later now. The sun is hiding behind some clouds. That eastern great egret is still here, but now that little egret is joined by another couple of little egrets there. For them, this is the best time of the day. Trying to get one last feed in before nightfall. So if you enjoyed the video, give it a big thumbs up, stay safe, enjoy your wildlife photography, and I'll see you next time.